Here I have a sphere and a cylinder. I want the sphere to fall on the cylinder and break. And as it breaks, I want time to slow down. To do that, we right click on the cylinder, go to bullet tags and choose collider body, make it a collider and add the uh, Voronoi fracture object into the scene and make the sphere a child of the Voronoi fracture. Uh, right click on the Voronoi fracture, do the same, go to bullet uh, tags and select rigid body. Uh, select the Voronoi Fracture as well and uncheck Colorize Fragments. And now if you play the animation, you'll see the ball falls down and breaks. I want the, uh, as it breaks, I want time to slow down. To do that, we have to Control D, click Control D, go to Bullet, and from the General tab, here you can see Time Scale. Uh, let's play the animation, see where the ball uh, touches. The cylinder, it's on frame roughly on frame 20 so I want to put a keyframe on frame 20 uh, on, on the time scale and then go forward like five frames slow time to 10% and move forward to frame 50 and uh, keep the time scale at 10 so add another keyframe and bring it back at 60 to 100 to a value of 100 and let's uh, play back the animation this is how it looks